This is Stuart Richardson representing Birmingham TUC today. We've organised an emergency protest against the new police bill going through Parliament. Uh, it is a bill which restricts the right of trade unionists to carry out their normal business to people protesting about uh, things. It's also particularly directed towards people like Extinction Rebellion, who've organised some dramatic demonstrations, but also historically the Stop the War Coalition, which organised large and loud demonstrations. And that's why we're here today. The government is trying to restrict our right to protest and make it easier to convict peaceful protesters. This is an attempt to scare us, but we are not more scared of the rules than we are scared of living in a world where nine out of ten people breathe air that is high levels of pollutants and 10,000 metres cubed of ice is lost per second in Greenland. So we are fighting to kill the bill, but we will never stop fighting. We will join together and rise up against the capitalist society. Good evening. My name is Ian Scott, President of the Birmingham Trade Union Council. We are assembled here tonight with the final way of speakers from various trade unions affiliated to the BTUSC and we are organising and campaigning against the Kill the Bill. Kill the Bill, this policing bill put forward by the current government is an attack on our civil liberties, our rights and our ability to demonstrate. One of the greatest dangers posing all of us is the fact that when they start to privatise the National Health Service, any protest or opposition we make to it can be criminalised, therefore muting any opposition to a, such a dr draconian proposal from this government. That's only one example of a great many others. Obviously, when we talk about the Kashmiris, protest against what the Indian government's doing, protesting against other pro forms of privatisation, protesting against other initiatives from this government, the whole thing is a danger and it needs stopping and stopping now. We are here today protesting against the new bill which is going through Parliament this bill will give more power to the police. Police can stop any protests against any dissent that we have on international issues and local issues here in this country. So we are opposing this bill. We are asking Member of Parliament to oppose this bill. And in democracy, everybody has a right to protest if they are not happy with anything. If there's human right abuses going on in any part of the world, we have right to protest. If this bill becomes law, they will stop us from protesting about Palestine, protesting about Kashmir, or India, or any other part of the world where human right abuses are going on. Hi, yeah, my name's Doug Morgan. I'm an activist with the National Education Union, also with Socialist Workers' Party and Birmingham Trades Council. And we're out here protesting today uh, over the Police Crime Sentencing and Courts Bill, which uh, will curtail the right to protest. And this is something that we're going to need to do more and more. We're going to need to protest because we've got a government of bigots, a, a government of spivs that want to privatise things, that want to cut services. And we're out saying that we... We should have the right to say no. And, you know, the government wants to take away our rights at a time when we will need them most. So we are saying to people, if you protested over Black Lives Matter, Extinction Rebellion, over Sarah Everard and everything else, we need to come out and keep protesting again to make certain that we have the rights to do this so we can defend working class lives and conditions.